Hello, this is Sasha reporting to you from New Orleans. New Orleans is the locals call it. New Orleans, Louisiana, and I'm riding the trolley, the St. Charles streetcar, trying to show you my favorite house on this St. Charles Avenue. I'm going to show you a little bit of the inside of the streetcar while it gets going. Both sides of the street are covered with beautiful houses, mansions, and uh, they are mostly, all of them, worth millions of dollars because this is prime real estate. So we're getting closer to that place. It's uh, going to be a surprise to you, but it's a beautiful, beautiful house. And uh, in my opinion, it is worth celebrating it. it uh, I've done a little bit of research and it seems to be possibly the only replica of the house that I'm going to be describing. I don't want to tell you the name yet, but um, you're going to be surprised. It is a beautiful, beautiful house. And like I said, there are a lot of people riding. It's a Friday afternoon, and uh, the afternoon, the sun and the trees and the shade are just so beautiful. I just had to share this with you. So here it goes. We are getting closer and closer. We are approaching that wonderful house. So that house is beautiful. It's got a Roman statue right there in the middle and uh, we're almost there we are like about a block away this is the St. Charles streetcar line St. Charles streetcar line <laughs> get nervous okay there it is it's coming up coming up there it is this is a replica of Terra from Gone with the Wind you see it Terra from Gone with the Wind and it is a replica of that house I've already done another video where you can see it where I get off the streetcar and uh, walk around I do a walk around uh, showing you and talking about it I also read the plaque that was recently installed when I first saw it I knew that that was Tara from the movie Gone with the Wind remember that movie Gone with the Wind and uh, in the novel remember the Scarlet O'Hara and Red Butler they honeymooned here in New Orleans they honeymooned here in New Orleans so it is very probable that they rode the St. Charles streetcar line which got its start in 1835 1835 it has been rolling down St. Charles Avenue since 1835 so that would cover the war years for the uh, Civil War and uh, a little bit after is when Red Butler and uh, Scarlett O'Hara married and uh, came to honeymoon in New Orleans. So it is very probable that they rode the St. Charles streetcar and uh, chatted about their plans for the future and uh, all the love that Red felt for Scarlett, I guess he was showing it, and she was also showing some of it. So uh, on this side, there are still a lot of houses here. This is like I said, prime real estate. The trees are famous, they are the live oaks. They have been around a long time in one of my other videos I give an estimate from 100 years to 250 years possibly 300 years because New Orleans is a very old old city 
now right there is Loyola University Loyola University Loyola University one of the two famous universities here in New Orleans of course they're all famous and uh, coming up is Tulane University right there that's one of the buildings of uh, Tulane University uh, I'll show you more of that when the trolley gets started again a lot of people are getting off here they're either relatives or they're uh, tourists looking to get a good view of Tulane University it's a beautiful university very famous they both are Loyola and Tulane University look at it it is fabulous the main building and there's the name people are taking pictures and um, happy that they graduated now on this side is uh, Audubon Park that is the main entrance to Audubon Park and let me show you that on this side trying to get on this side because this is really really nice whoops <laughs> sorry about that and uh, you can see the sun shining that is Audubon Park locals come and uh, also tourists students anybody that wants to they come and they take a jog run walk walk their dogs This used to be a plantation that was later given to the city after a long, drawn out fight in the courts. Let me show you a little bit more of a close up of some of the houses. Look at that, somebody's having a party there, a gathering. Of course, today is Friday, so a lot of uh, celebration is going on in some of these places. So, I guess that's all for now. I don't want to make it too long. But that was the main thing that I wanted to show you. So, thanks a lot for watching. This is Sasha saying thank you and bye for now.